we've been made. Means, we have been found out, we have been discovered, they know about us, etc. The best of both worlds. A situation, in which you can enjoy the advantages of two very different things, at the same time. Nice going. Often used in an ironic way, to say that something someone did, was stupid. Basic meaning, good job. No holds barred. Without limits, or controls. Get out. Said when you are surprised by something, or don't believe it. Informal. Best not. Means, you better not do something. Now you're talking. Used to say that someone has said or suggested something that you thinks is good or worth doing. My ass. Informal expression used to emphasize that you don't believe or accept what someone has said. How about that? Used to emphasize that something is surprising or impressive. Said as an exclamation rather than a question. You don't say. Used either to express surprise or lack of surprise in a humorous and slightly unkind way. Tell me about it. Used to say that you understand what someone is talking about because you have had the same or a similar experience. It's high time. Used to say it is time to do something that should have been done a long time ago. Take for granted. To expect that someone or something will always be there when you need them and never think how important or useful they are. Day in and day out. Means that something happens regularly over a long period of time. Especially about something boring. For good measure. In addition to what has already been done or said. As a way of making something better. Be bound to. Having a moral or legal duty to do something. Used to express or describe an unavoidable action. Take a sweet time. To take a long time to do something. To do something at someone's own preferred pace without consideration for how it will affect others. Come on strong. To have forceful intentions, while dealing, or talking with someone, or being too demanding about something. To behave aggressively. Play it cool. To behave in a calm, controlled way. Often intentionally appearing not to be interested in the thing, that you very much want to get. By all means. Used for agreeing or giving permission. Be fond of. To like someone or something very much, especially when you have known them or it for a long time. A hoot and a half. Refers to something that is very funny or very fun to do. Something extremely enjoyable. Bring it on. Used to express confidence in meeting a challenge. Said to show that you are prepared and willing to compete in a competition or to do something difficult. Mind your business. Used to tell someone in a rude way that you do not want them to ask about something private. Means, do your normal activities without affecting others. Speak of the devil. Said, when a person appears, just after being mentioned. Hit me. Means, go ahead and ask me your question, or tell me what you were going to say. In blackjack, a request for the dealer, to give you another card. Used as a request for an alcoholic drink. Informal. Where I shine. To do something very well. Usually better than other people have been meaning to. Two of the intention, desire, or obligation to do something. 
used especially when you forget to do something, or when something does not happen in the way you intended. <laughs> to run errands. To make short journeys, to buy, collect, or deliver something. In a nutshell. Used to indicate that you are saying something in a very brief way, using few words. Giving only the main points. <laughs> Take someone's word for it. Means, to believe that, what someone says, is true. Knock it off. Used to tell someone to stop doing something, especially something that annoys you. What's the catch? Used when someone believes that an offer is too good to be true, and they think the deal is presented on its best side, and that problems are being hidden. <laughs> Happen to do, or be. Means, to do something, or be somewhere by chance. To think less of someone. To not respect someone as much, as you did before. To have a lower opinion of someone. Be all ears. If you are all ears, you are ready, and eager to listen, to what someone is saying. Get cracking. To start doing something quickly. To work, or move more quickly. Informal. I don't buy it. Means, I don't believe it. I'm not convinced. Duly noted. To take note of the information, for later consideration. If used sarcastically, it means the opposite. Get it together. To take action, to become well organized, prepared, or in a better state. To become fit, relaxed, and rational. Tough break. Means, bad luck, unfortunate situation, or it's a difficult time, and used when something doesn't go your way. In the long run, at a time that is far away in the future. At some time in the future. Suit yourself. Used for telling someone to do what is convenient for them. Means, okay, do what you want to do, it's no problem. What is up with? Means, what is the reason for something? Why is it happening? What is wrong with something or someone? Stay sharp. To be alert. To pay close attention. To be prepared, to deal with something dangerous, or unexpected. Back and forth. If someone moves back and forth, they repeatedly move in one direction, and then in the opposite direction. From side to side. From one to the other. I don't feel like it. Means, I don't really want to do it, I have no desire to do, or have it. In the first place, used when you are talking about the beginning of a situation, or about the situation, as it was before, a series of events. It's go time. Means, it's time to do something. It's time to get serious about doing something. <laughs> get this straight. To correctly understand something. To have a clear understanding of something. None taken. Means, I was not offended, or insulted by what you just said. Mostly used in response to the expression, no offense. No offense. Used to say in order to make it clear, that you do not want to upset someone. Although what you are saying, may seem rather rude. Shame on you. Used for telling someone, that they should feel guilty, or embarrassed. Means, you should feel ashamed, of what you have done. <laughs> Lay it on me. To present, or reveal something to someone. Means, tell me whatever it is. Or tell me whatever is bothering you. Informal. Fall short. To not reach a particular level, or to fail to achieve something that you are trying to do. To be less than the amount or standard, that is needed. Stick it out. To continue doing something to the end, 
even when it is difficult or boring. Jump to conclusions. To guess the facts about a situation, without having enough information. Go figure. Shortened form of the concept, try to figure that one out. Used to say, that you cannot explain, or understand something surprising, stupid, or hard to understand. Used to express the belief, that something is incredible. Out of your depth. Means you not have the knowledge, experience, or skills, to deal with a particular subject, or situation. I second that. Used for telling someone that you agree, with what they are saying. Means, I agree, or I support that. I'm racking my brain. To try very hard to recall, or think of something. To think very hard. Sit tight. To stay where you are. To wait patiently, and take no action. Does not necessarily refer to sitting. <laughs> off the top of my head. If you say a fact off the top of your head, you say it immediately, from memory, or without thinking carefully. Don't hesitate to do something. Used to tell someone, that it is correct, or right for them to do something, and they do not have to worry about it. Used for encouraging someone to do something. It's been a while. This expression, often follows a greeting. And means it's been a long time since we saw each other. Here's the thing. Means, this is what I want to say. This is point. I want to make. On the one hand, on the other hand. Used to introduce a point of view, fact, or situation, followed by another, that typically contrasts with it. <laughs> Last but not least. Used to say, that a final statement, is not less important, than previous statements. <laughs> Long story short. Means, let's get to the point, skipping over unnecessary details. <laughs> Give me a break. Give someone a break. Used to tell someone, to stop bothering you or treating you unfairly. You have no idea. Used for describing how good, or bad an experience is. Sounds good to me. Used for telling someone, that their idea, or suggestion seems like a good one. No way. Used to tell someone that something is impossible. Used to express surprise. I mean it. Means, I'm serious, or I'm telling the truth. Make up mind. To make a decision about something. To decide. Makes sense. To be reasonable, or have a clear meaning. If something makes sense, there seems to be a good reason or explanation for it. Make fun of someone. To laugh at someone, by making jokes in an unkind way. Make a day of it. To spend the whole day, instead of just part of it, doing something enjoyable. You're gonna make it. Means, you will be successful in what you do, just keep going, and don't beat yourself up. <laughs>